America's newest nuclear power plants will be built in Georgia. The Nuclear Regulatory Commission approved permits for building the facilities, despite a recommendation from the commission's chairman to reconsider. The move stunned many anti-nuclear advocates since the decision comes less than a year after the accident at Japan's Fukushima power plant. So we believe that this decision is rather ill-conceived and dangerous because it really allows the uh, nuclear industry to proceed with uh, new construction of nuclear power plants without taking into account the real concerns that we have about the safety of those plants. The new nuclear permits are the first in more than 30 years and the first since the accident at the Three Mile Island facility in Pennsylvania. Since the meltdown there in 1979, the debate over nuclear power in America has raged. Opponents have said the risks of building the plants outweigh the benefits, while proponents insist nuclear power is more reliable than wind or solar power as alternatives to oil and gas. There are 104 nuclear power plants in the United States. That puts more than a third of the U.S. population within 50 miles of one of those facilities. Safety has always been an issue raised by anti-nuclear advocates. Cost is another factor. The two facilities in Georgia will reportedly cost an estimated $17 billion. It shows confidence in our nuclear industry, shows new development in energy production, which we need for our economy. And I think it may serve to uh, be the start of a trend because there are many other license applications in line for similar plants. The new plants will be built by the Southern Company, which already has two aging silos at the site. Environmental groups have filed a lawsuit to stop construction, claiming the design of America's newest nuclear power plants are similar to the ones that failed in Japan last March after an earthquake and tsunami. We are some 130 miles from the coastline. We are 220 feet above sea level. We are not in a seismic sensitive area. But opponents of nuclear energy say not so fast. They plan to resist the efforts for more nuclear power plants in America with lawsuits, protests, and their votes. Gary Anthony Ramsey, Press TV, New York.